So this is a mowing troll, mowing uh, valve for the shower. You'll see here the 1423 balancing uh, spool, it's called. Uh, the problem with this thing is to get it out, it's like a long slotted screwdriver, but any of the normally commercially available screwdrivers are just too small. So I took a, I took a nice new cheapo model uh, one inch chisel as suggested in a comment on another one on YouTube and I, I took it to the grindstone and I, grown, I ground this as flat as a pancake gave it a, uh, a profile which is kind of uh, screwdriver like and I'm going to try it fits nicely make sure the uh, the edges were crisp but I'm gonna take this I'm gonna take this knob off because I don't want that to get in the way so I'm pausing it okay let's see if this works uh, it worked perfectly that. all right I'm gonna loosen that up and out she comes uh, so I don't drop any parts inside the thing I think I'll put a, a cup of some sort maybe of fabric underneath there Mm. I have no idea what's going to happen when this comes out. Balancing valve. Mm. Mm. Takes a bit of loosening. Water is starting to come out, which is not a problem. It's plumbing, so you kind of expect it. Now I have another rag on standby. Keep us from dribbling too much water down. Probably a bunch of mineral deposits. A whole pile of mineral deposits behind the uh, this big nut. And uh, that's what's making it hard to uh, break it out. <laughs> the old hair. Get this off. Work it out. Nothing like having a one inch wide screwdriver. Uh, I felt that. Oops, easy. Oh, seems to be going around. Yeah, that's right. It doesn't want to come out. Very interesting. Here I was at the hardware store yesterday. And I didn't pick up some of those wire picks. That's for a dental pick so I could pull that. Uh... Hmm. I might give that a good tap. Loosen it up. Yeah. I'm gonna loosen it a little bit. We 
can just pick that off. Yep, time to get out the uh, big pliers. Just have to make sure I don't drop that down the back. Okay, the big pliers. According to oil, that worked nicely. Catch that uh, dripping water. So that is what a 1423 balancing spool looks like. It's got a, a twisty end. It's just crimped on, and a few. Uh, few o-rings and a body inside there and things inside that move around not much to it so the recommended troubleshooting solution for this let it sit in water or sorry half and half vinegar and water solution for about five six minutes clean it with a toothbrush and stick it back in I'll do that and I'll also make sure I uh, lube these up with some of that um, 3M uh, silicone gasket stuff. Good. Okay, strange but true. I'm going to take an Allen key and stick it in there and tap at the bottom of this because the piston inside here is a little bit stuck. 